Well, I'd certainly love to win it. <laughs> and hopefully this year I'll have the, I'll have the horse to win it with. Uh, my father holds the record of, of number of derbies won in Australasia, plus, of course, number of derbies won here at Randwick. It's a most prestigious race. If you're looking for a horse that, in, as a four-year-old, will go on and be maybe a Caulfield Cup, Melbourne Cup horse, if you're looking for a horse that could be uh, a Cox Plate horse, then, of course, you'd like to be see, thinking you could win the derby. I won the Caulfield Cup last year, ran second here in the derby to sh uh, shoot out. I would look for a staying type horse, because the horse that wins the Australian derby here in the autumn doesn't win the Victorian derby in the spring. It's a more precocious horse that wins that, and this is a horse that really needs the trip, the 2,400 metres, a mile and a half. So, you know, you're looking for a horse that can stay, you're looking for a horse that will go on as a four-year-old. You know, it's a lovely stepping stone into the Group 1 races of the spring, and it's the pinnacle in the autumn. It's won by the best. Last year's shootout was a perfect example. You know, he was the best horse racing in, uh, in Melbourne and Sydney at the time, and he dominated the derby here. The horse that ran second, Desperado, again went on and, as I said, ran second in the McKinnon and won the Caulfield Cup. You know, both outstanding horses. I think it's very important to have tradition, and I think it's lovely that we have the derby, the Australian derby race run uh, in the autumn here. In 57, a swayback colt was sent out a 9-4 to four on favour. His name, the Mighty Tullock. I often asked Dad, Kingston Town and Tullock, which would you say was the better horse? And he said, Tullock came at a time of my life where I really needed, only needed the dollars. Uh, and Kingston Town, he said, they were the greatest, they were the two greatest horses. Kingston Town won, do, won this race and dominated. And you, on face value, you probably thought he wasn't going to you know, be able to run the trip. And he was just completely dominant of his rivals. The only quality horse wins this race.